Hey, Chris, uh, we have a little bit of a miracle here in the aftermath of the storm. You see a number of people surrounding a baby loggerhead turtle right down there, a hatchling as it heads its way to the sea. There, people are standing around it, uh, and it's probably a good thing they are before any of the birds get it. It's, uh, it's after the hatching season, which usually ends in October, but a bit of a miracle we're here seeing here on Hobe Sound Beach as this poor little baby struggles to get to the sea and hopefully living a good life after that. This is something that we've seen uh, rarely here. It's out of the wild and quite a miracle going on here. Uh, earlier today, people were here to see the sunrise. They were here to see uh, an incredible sunrise. If you look to the north, you'll see gray skies. And look at the white caps. The sea is white today. Um, strong offshore winds have uh, made for quite a spectacle as well. And uh, it sea's been roiling up there. We talked to a couple of people who were surfers who thought that uh, this would be ideal, except the waves breaking too far from shore and potentially dangerous as well. Let's go back to the turtle, though, because that's, uh, I think, what people are talking about. He's, he or she is about a third of the way of the journey on the sea. you got to love the determination here, just with those little front flappers just trying to make it out and a crowd of people around to make sure, uh, make sure this little baby can make it to the sea again. This is something that was totally unexpected because the... Uh, the hatching season runs from March and ends in October, and usually most of the hatchlings, uh, you know, take place uh, during the summer months. We've got a big wave coming up that people are seeing, lots of pictures going on. But this is a moment many will remember after the hurricane as we watch the baby head out into the Atlantic. Reporting live in Hobe Sound, I'm Dave Bowman, WPTV News Channel 5.